iMove is a peer mentoring program primarily targeting youth at the Nova Scotia Youth Facility who are at risk of or involved in gang activity. The program helps youth build self-awareness through personal storytelling, performance art, music, filmmaking, and social media activities. iMove provides opportunity for young people to be heard and give voice to their expression through media, through radio, television, through other forms of expression like writing and, and creative drawings and that sort of thing. And these can be youth, some of them could be at risk, some of them are in conflict with the law, and some of them are youth trying to find a way to be heard. The first phase of the program, it was a, just a short pilot to, to sort of jumpstart the program. The collective made a video uh, with young people's voice in the video that really showed the potential for the work. So they learned the skills of a sound and how to use a camera. Those young people, they began to work closer with Sobez Benjamin to become mentors. Our aim is to run two 12-week programs out of the Nova Scotia Youth Facility. The youth who are in conflict with the law, they've, they've sort of disengaged from a lot of mainstream or conventional avenues of expression, so school is problematic. A lot of doors have been either closed or been slammed shut on them. How do we get them to engage with us? Part of that approach is the peer mentorship piece. Bringing in people who look like them, come from the same communities that they come from, face similar challenges, who are saying, you know, I did it, you can do it also. The young offenders we work with, once they get out of youth facilities or correctional facilities, they get an opportunity to work with us and we have a number of interesting community-based projects we do, video-based, theatre-based, that they'll get an opportunity to sort of reintegrate back into healthy community. We use popular culture to engage young people. Hip-hop music is very popular, film, radio, you know, those cool things. There's a cool factor to the tools of engagement that iMove uses. It enables us to kind of pursue whatever goals they may have, goals such as you know, completing an English class or completing education in, in other regards as well. To deliver the program, the major issue was around confidentiality. Like, how do we keep the confidentiality of these young people so that we're respecting their rights in the institution? I think one of the challenges we're currently facing is getting resources in order, whether it be money or equipment or people, to be able to allow our youth and adult mentors to do the very valuable work that they do so that they can continue to do what they've been doing for, for a while, for, for free. Can you guys hear me? Are the you live? Collective allows young people to take the skills that they're learning and to be able to transfer those skills into other areas that they may be interested in. They empower the leadership inside of a young person through voice to be able to do that.